Hey, thanks for checking us out. I'm Cor Crossan. This is Crossan C's Tips and Tricks, and today I'm going to be covering copywriting. Now, I'm not the best in the world at copywriting, but at least I'm trying, and I'm going to be covering some things that I've learned along the way. Some of the things that I've learned from great copywriters. Um, I read some books, you know. That being said, remember to like, share, subscribe. Also in the description box below, there's gonna be a link to my number one way to make money online. Click on it, uh, get on my email list, and watch the video afterwards. It's a video that really helped me and got me pointed in the right direction when starting my business, and I hope it does the same for you. Uh, that being said, uh, let's go to those tips and tricks. All right, tips and tricks, copywriting. Let's get to it. All right, tip number one, don't write about yourself. Make everything about the person reading your copy. Now. A lot of times we get started in this and we focus on like, I want to give you this, I want to do this, and I want to provide you this and give you help and do this. It's I, I, I. Uh, you don't want to do that. What you want to do is make it about the person and the product and write about how the certain features will benefit you in a certain way and solve some problems. That's really important one. Uh, no one cares about you in your own copywriting. They, most people are mo interested in themselves. Here's a trick. Create a swipe file. Now, this is a collection of ads, landing pages, sales letters, advertorials, and videos that you know are killing it. You don't want to collect uh, swipe files of ads that are just trash. Make sure they're from professionals, that they're um, actually performing well, and that they're the type of advertising you're doing. So if you're an affiliate marketer, you're doing performance marketing. Well, if you're a Coca-Cola, you're doing a much broader uh, blanket thing. So you use this swipe file as inspiration for your own ads. Uh, you mimic them. You can even use them as a template. Um, but you just make it your own. And that's pretty much it. I mean, you could use a back pain uh, article um for uh, something like uh, make money online you can do that I've seen it done and you, you just swipe it out and just change the um, subject and it sounds really good good copy is good copy all right tip number two it's never one size fits all every audience and every channel you promote on has a different personality and responds uniquely so a blog is going to act different from a blog your personal blog is actually going to act different from a blog on tumblr and then uh, Tumblr is that Tumblr? Yeah, Tumblr. And then um, let's say your Instagram account is going to act differently from uh, your Facebook account. And so whatever you write and everything, you have to make it custom to that audience and custom to the median that you're promoting on. All right, tip number three: the most important thing is the headline. If you're not grabbing people's attention with your headline, the rest of your sales funnel is worthless. So grab their attention with the head headline make sure your headline is relevant make sure your headline is catchy and it creates curiosity or a strong impulse to click on it all right let's get to our next one tip number four a confused mind says no be clear and easy to follow this is a really important tip so uh, just be clear and easy to follow i tend to ramble so this is like a very important thing for me this is like one that i have to focus on constantly yeah if you're confused you're like i don't need this i don't want this or you make it too complicated people just get lose interest and they just click away thank you for watching this is cross and c's tips and tricks for copywriting remember to like share subscribe also in the description box below there's gonna be a link to my number one way to make money online click on it get put in your name and email get on my email list and watch the video afterwards the video is one that i watched when i started getting um, interested in uh, starting a business online and it, it got me connected to the right group of people pointing me in the right direction and it I've gotten so much farther because I watched that single video and took the steps afterwards. And I hope you do the same. And, uh, and here's to your success.